We're here at the Maker Fair 2010. Well, here we're showing off uh, a bunch of projects that were made at home. You can get 15.4 volts at 10 amps from this device. Uh, using ballast tanks to fill with water or air. The ceases and electromagnetic pulse. The wings open up and it goes into a glide configuration. Transmit electricity wirelessly through the air. Remember Metro Home School Robotics came to Maker Fair because we want to show off the Vomitron. Um, it competed in an FRC competition. We got second place and the assimilator over here. Um, that competed in Best Robotics and we won national championship with that robot. We have this styrofoam cutting machine and it uses a, a process of perforating. Stepper motors move this head around and it cuts all these different shapes. We're the KC Space Pirates, demonstrating the space elevator and trying to win a million dollar NASA prize. This uses an electromagnetic pulse to shred an aluminum can. Awesome. Kansas City Robotics Society. We're out here supporting robotics in the local area. We like to bring out some robots that uh, kids can build on their own. With, uh, no experience and no programming necessary. We've got a couple of them down here. Well, the Tesla coil is an air core resonant transformer invented by Nikola Tesla in um, the 1880s. Hi, uh, I'm standing in front of a uh, wooden replica, a replica of a prototype of a submarine built in 1894 by Simon Lake. K is uh, modeling a, a period specific uh, dive helmet also that goes with the submarine. I'm here with my MakerBot and my assorted creations. There's a uh, machine over there which is called a Mendel, which is. <laughs> you know, the whole idea. We're making security screwdrivers so that you can open and own your very own Happy Meal toys.
Basically what this does is static electricity builds up in the two discs and rotating in opposite directions. And then it has a charge that goes from one side that's positive and negative, and then they seek each other and they're discharged. So the idea here is to collect heat uh, as efficiently as possible. Uh, this device can gather heat very quickly, and now the heat becomes the energy source. Roger Dodger Aviation with the missile lamps, the lamps that look like missiles. It's kind of a demonstration on uh, how amateur radio works. Uh, it's an organized fashion of communication uh, uh, from one uh, amateur operator to another. Uh, also, you can make contact with uh, people on other continents, other countries, other states. <laughs> Now, this is Kay talking. <laughs> now, here, here we go. <laughs> it's a great video, I tell you.